Greetings everyone, my name is Hatsana. I am the Minister of the Grove, and I'm gonna be coming to you over the next few days, introducing you to some goddesses that are associated with wolves and ways that you can maybe honor them or get to know them a little better if you're interested. So the first goddess that we're gonna be talking about is the Roman goddess Diana. I don't know how many people actually associate her with wolves, but she definitely had a very strong association. She is known as the goddess of hunting and of the moon and as a protector of women and children. And she is still known in that role today. Her domain ruled the forest and all within, including wolves, of course. And now as associations are made with wolves and the wild woman, bringing us back to our primal original roots, Diana's link with wildlife and womanhood and connections to the wolves become even more obvious. If you would like to create an altar to Diana in your home, you can use any of her symbols, especially the moon, moonstones, any woodland animals, wolves of course included. You can also add a statue of her. She likes a light silver or a white candle and she also enjoys offerings of water. So you could make a small ball of water and put that on her altar. She loves rose and sandalwood incenses. So those you could burn for her. And you could honor Diana by helping to save the forest, woodlands, and wild animals in our local area. Also, the Grove has a Friends of Animals Committee. We collect animal food for dogs, cats, uh, anything that you would use uh, to make an animal's life happier and better. And then we have a no-kill shelter that we donate to on a monthly basis. So if you're interested in maybe joining that program and making a donation to the animals that would help local animals in our immediate area, you can email me at abelinasgrove at gmail.com and we will make arrangements to pick up the items from you. Thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed this and I'll see you again.